Hello everybody, this is Carlo from Terragon.de and in this tutorial we want to see how to make a simple input-output um, yeah, PHP script that is integrated into our TYPO3 system. So this will allow us to realize a simple calculator or something to calculate like uh, money exchange or something that uh, has to be calculated in a simple way. So we want to start uh, f based on our last tutorial and uh, this tutorial needs you to install your PHP extension and you need to have the opportunity um, to insert PHP scripts into your TYPO3 system and um, now we will use uh, Dreamweaver to create our PHP script. So I want to pop up a new document and I normally choose the we have the code view or the um, design view of our page but we need only the code view but we can have the shared view too that we will see both okay so now I want to start in the in the design view and I want to insert a simple table I hope uh, you guys know how to realize that I want to make it a little more a little smaller for here and um, now he will generate the ph uh, the HTML code here and we can integrate our PHP code inside so I want uh, to make a simple calculator for square meters and we want to have um, the result in square meters that we want to be shown here and we want the length here the width here and um, we need to put uh, okay I forgot to edit a formula a form and we want to insert a form here and copy our table inside our form and if we want to work into our TYPO3 system we need to know um, the ID of our uh, page that we want to paste our script in and uh, at this time we have this page where we have shown our PHP script that is the starting page but that's okay for the first test and it has the ID number 6 so having that in mind I want to insert the action of the form script um, index.php question mark id equals 6 so if we press the button that I have to insert now the send button um, in English it's send <laughs> um, then he will make this action here and he will post our information into page 6 and um, now we can add some other form elements that we want to insert a text field a text field is important for us to insert our length in meter for example 
and insert another text field in meter again so we have the result in square meters later and um, now we can limit the width and the amount of uh, chars that will go inside our box here that we can make like this 5, 5, that will be enough we don't want to have more than 5 numbers inside okay so this is our in your normal uh, standard name we can call it calculator um, for our HTML form so if we are so far we can copy our uh, code copy and switch into our typo 3 system and paste it here into our PHP script save and watch the result and we will see ok he inserted our table in the typo 3 system already but if I s press send it will not do anything so we have to, edit, uh, to add some PHP script into our HTML uh, code snippet here and for that we want to give uh, our but our form fields uh, or form elements the right names and IDs if you're not familiar with um, HTML you maybe want to look some other tutorials that will teach you how to work with this okay for the PHP plugin it is important that uh, the PHP script will be at the beginning of the script of the uh, script file so I want to add the PHP script here on the top and um, maybe you want to Google how to import uh, the form element data into a PHP script um, I will just copy and paste it here so I want to um, set the variable length equals post post okay so we have imported the form data of the post uh, of the lengths and now we want to do the same with width maybe you know this uh, action by using the get statement but uh, we used in our form the post method so we have to use the post import here too and now we have imported both numbers that are inserted here in our uh, two fields and now we can come to the real PHP script and we want to um, define a new variable that is um, square meters equals I will copy length multiplied with with and so we calculated our square meters and if we want to show the result here in our table we have we will see that the 
pointer here will change the position in Dreamweaver, but if we don't use Dreamweaver we need to do it manually, but we can add PHP scripts nearly everywhere we want. So we can just type echo square meters echo square meters. Okay. Now we have one PHP script that is importing the length and the width, calculating the square meters, and we have a PHP script that outputs our square meters put here. Yes shown here. So we can copy our whole script again. Copy. And import it in our typo3 uh, PHP code. Completely replace the whole script. Click watch again. And now we have the result is zero. And if I type here 12 and 34 and click send, he will... and we see there is still zero. That is because XAMPP is in normal mode uh, turning register globals off and we need to turn register globals on. And for that we will go into the php.ini. So we will pop up our XAM folder and we go into the XAM PHP where we want to look for the PHP INI. Open it with our editor and in our editor we have to look for register this is it register globals off and we can type in register globals on save the php any close it and go back to our XAMPP, XAMPP control, stop the Apache, start it again, and now we can reload our page here, edit the 12 and 34 again, and it still doesn't work. Okay, I have one thing in mind. That will be it. Yes. Um, PHP is very case sensitive, so if I want um, to import the lengths with the big L, I have to use the variable with the big L too, so there will be no problems, and I will save and view this again type in our very our numbers again type send and he will calculate it for me okay perfect so now we have our own simple calculator that we can use uh, for different calculations and um, inside our Type of 3 system. So this will allow us um, to have many calculators in our systems and use some other stuff with PHP. So I hope you enjoyed this short tutorial and you want to make your own calculating PHP scripts in Type 3 as well. Um, and for the next PHP steps, we will use our next tutorial. So, see you later.